students welcome back to new video i hope you enjoyed the last videos today i am going to teach you about the taxonomy systematics and taxonomy categories taxonomy systematics and taxonomy categories one more thing students don't forget your uh, whatever your doubt put in your comment section taxonomy the term taxonomy was given by the candola the systematic terms given by the kelvas linnaeus okay what is taxonomy taxonomy is a branch of science which deals with the classification identification and nomenclature of an organism taxonomy is the identification nomenclature and classification of organism is known as your taxonomy systematic is both taxonomy and the relationship of the organism to its evolution taxonomy and its evolutionary relationship is known as your systematic and carlos linnaeus who was known as the father of taxonomy he written in his book systema natura systema natura in his book he arranged the organism on the basis of systematics means taxonomy and its relations to the evolution cell the name of the book is systema natura sometimes in the Uh, your exam it is asked in mcq okay carlos linnaeus is known as the father of taxonomy and carlos linnaeus first divided the organisms on the basis of level and that level is known as your taxonomy categories level so level that level is known as your taxa and in scientific scientific term we know as the taxa what are the taxon or level given by the carlos linnaeus he is given genus species okay order class and varieties okay carlos linnaeus divided organism on the basis of genus species order class and varieties and now new it is included you know phylum or division okay and family understood these things are newly added well this files are given by the carlos linnaeus in taxonomy categories on the basis of taxon we will arrange the organism in an order that is known as a hierarchical order it may be in the ascending order or it may be in the descending order we will start from your kingdom okay then phylum or division okay then class order Family, genus, and species. The low lowest categories or lowest level in this hierarchical order is the species. Lowest. Okay. And the highest position we got by a kingdom. Highest or In an order, your topmost position will be your kingdom, and species is the last bottom position.
equation in a hierarchical order. Means group of similar organisms, closely related organisms are in the group of species. Okay? And group of species are in the genus. And group of genus make this family. And group of family make this order. Group of order make the class. And group of class make this your division of phylum. Then all division and phylum in the one order that is your kingdom. And each one is known as your section. Kingdom is a section. Division is a section. Class is a section. Order is a section. These are all section. Understood? Whatever I taught you today. Taxonomy, systematics and taxonomy categories. Taxonomy term was given by Candola. Where is the systematics term was given by the Carolus Linus. And first we have to know what is the taxonomy. It is the branch of science which deals with your identification, nomenclature and classification of organisms. But in case of systematics, apart from your taxonomy, one more thing is added here, the organism's relation to its evolution. So taxonomy and its evolutionary relationship is known as a systematics. But in taxonomy categories, at the level or taxon, basis based on that, we can divide the organisms in a hierarchical order. Maybe descending to ascending or ascending to descending order. Okay. But here I arrange in the top two model. Lowest one is your species and top most one is the kingdom. Next, Carlos Linnaeus written this classification in his book in the System of Nature, where he divide the organisms, genus, species, order, class and varieties. And newly added is the kingdom, phylum and family. When newly formed, the varieties is not included. Okay? Means on the basis of seven section, the animals will be, the organisms will be classified. So. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay? Whenever we classify the organism, it should consist of the seven section. Understood? I hope you enjoy this video. Don't forget to share it, subscribe it and like it. If any doubt will arise, post it in the comment section. Thank you.